I'm very hungry. I'm hungry for food and I'm hungry for attention. So this is what I got, I guess. I got half mild, half Caribbean jerk, traditional wings, bone in. I just literally drooled right there. First up on the list, we have Lady Gaga. And this like all silver outfit with the bubble on it. Just looking at this already, I'm having an asthma attack. It's making me uncomfortable and I'm claustrophobic. I don't know about anybody else. Lady Gaga. Lady Gaga is a queen. Lady Gaga literally had like five alter egos and I'm here for it. Do you know all the masks she had? She's being like socially responsible. I feel like the mask with the horns is for people with like World of Warcraft kinks. Kiki Palmer. In this blue dress she literally looks like Tiana, like the princess went to a fucking nightclub. And then also she did drag. Honestly, I can so relate because, you know, we all have alter egos. She went for it, you know, she wore that Hawaiian shirt. Joey King. This is probably like one of the finest, this is probably one of like the finest outfits I've ever seen her in. I think she got those extensions in all straightened and shit. The dress, I like really like the dress. But it's also like, if you got one of those like couches from the 70s that's like brown and stuff, and you made it Christmas colors, I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about. But I mean, it looks good on her. Is that like Versace or something? I don't know. Versace sometimes go for that ugly look. No judge. She got like a little glitter of eyes, like red glittery, take me back to Kansas type shoes arm. They're cute. Madison Beer. Uh, Madison Beer is just hot, you know, plain and simple. She's hot. There's nothing, I mean, there's nothing like truly special about what she's wearing other than she's 100% that bitch, if you get what I'm saying. Like she's kind of seductive, classy with like the gloves with the rings on top of it. I'm here for it but it's also kind of based, I don't know. I don't know what my mood is with this one, other than she's just hot, you know? Oh, that's so good. So Jaden Smith, everybody's saying that he looks like a grandma on this sweater. Honestly, I'm kind of here for it. Personally, the three quarter sleeves would bother me if I was wearing it, but also, you know, every once in a while we need a cold breeze on our wrist. <laughs> like I get how people think it's like grandma, but I feel like, I see it as like a Tyler the Creator X Emma Chamberlain type beat. I'd wear it with like, I don't know, like a skirt or something that I don't have. Also, I like that Jaden is like cash. You know, he's like, fuck it. It's a VMAs, give me my sweater. You know what, the more I think about it, I fucking hate the three quarter sleeves. I get like, sure, I get that it's fashionable, but for my personal, where's the napkin? My nose is starting to run too. Hold up. Bella Hadid. I I like this outfit, but there's a lot of layers. Like I feel like they just kept putting on layers and they're like, nah, her tits are still showing. So they like slapped a sheer bra on and they're like, fuck, this doesn't work either. So they like threw a little black sensor on top of it, on top of her titties. I just want to be rich and like dress up, you know, and not look like I'm about to go jugging. Also, I like her hair. I feel like that's very 90s. Like it's very spiky. And she has like a good smoky eye on it. She got them gloves with exposed shoulder. Honestly, I don't understand this outfit. The more I talk about it. She's wearing pantyhose under those pants. That is some commitment. Pantyhose under pants for that like shoe, sheer I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just gonna shut up. The baby in the Jabberwockies. The baby in Louis Vuitton sweatpants like slash sleep pants. I'm here for it. It's like he just like rolled out of bed with like his chains and stuff on and he like left the walker at home. Is that a Supreme jacket he's wearing? Let's just put it out there. The baby can get it. So BTS, I guess that's like that K-pop stuff. 
I have no idea what it is, but they do dress pretty nice. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna need to get another wang. There's something about, I'm, I think I'm not into K-pop because I wasn't into One Direction. There's something about um, boy bands that just throws me off. I'm like, I don't think, what was that magazine? Like Pop Tiger or Tiger Beat. Yeah, like anything that like reminds me of the Tiger Beat magazine throws me off. It's like, I'm a grown up now. You know, no offense. I don't know. I literally have never listened to them. I know nothing about this K-pop group. Honestly, I'm just assuming that this is the K-pop group. I did no research on this. The Weeknd. I don't know how I feel about this. Um, he literally looks like Michael Jackson rose from the dead and he got a new pair of gloves. Like, that's the only thing I see. I wonder if he just, like, did this outfit to cover up, like, his face. Like, maybe he got jumped or something. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know the weekend's life. Also, I don't know how I feel about the white on black loafers. Like, it matches the outfit and everything. And it's very, like, I think he's going for an 80s, 90s look or something like that. But like in general, I don't like that like white on black, weird like kind of color blocking look. Not for me. Will I am? I like his outfit. On the like little news report I screenshotted this from, it says most cursed crotch. Most cursed, most cursed crotch. Honestly, when I die and I go towards the light, I hope that's the light that I go towards. Uh, Machine Gun Kelly can get it. I love the all hot pink look. Literally last night, I had a dream about Machine Gun Kelly. That I was like at his house party. We like really hit it off. We had like this deep conversation. And then I was like trying to come on to him. He was like, oh, I'm only into blondes. And so like, unfortunately at this party, Pete Davidson wasn't there. If Pete Davidson wasn't there, I wouldn't be worried. You know, I wouldn't have been but her. However, Pete Davidson, if you're watching this right now, Bang my line. Okay, I think that's all the people I have. That went by pretty fast, honestly. So I'm gonna go ahead and deuce out. Thank you for coming in. It's been a pleasure hosting you. Don't forget to like and subscribe and share my video. Thank you. Have a wonderful evening. Signing out.